안녕하세요. 한국 GM 제임스 캠 사장입니다. 오늘 전기차 신모델을 소개하고 퓨처 모빌리티 비전을 공유하겠습니다. 자, 이제 본격적으로 시작해 보겠습니다. 오늘 행사는 제가 GM의 외국 임원들을 모시고 진행합니다. The high level of connectivity and IT in vehicles today offers new possibilities unlike ever before. And I am super excited to be here to lead the discussion. Korea is one of the most advanced markets in terms of IT infrastructure, telecommunications, and connectivity. With this impressive ecosystem, Korea is the ideal testing ground for predicting the future of technology. And while more and more electric and hybrid vehicles are being introduced and sold globally, we believe Korea is the perfect country for GM to offer our most innovative and advanced new electric vehicles. Here in Korea, GM has been playing a leading role in promoting electric vehicle technology. We demonstrated development capabilities since 2011 with the Cruise electric vehicle and the Volt demo program conducted right here in Korea. We introduced the Chevrolet Spark electric vehicle, GM's first pure electric vehicle in Korea, engineered collaboratively between Korean and U.S. GM engineers, and as I said before, built right here in Korea. And a few months ago, we introduced the Malibu Hybrid and the Volt at the Busan International Motor Show. These two vehicles are the most technologically advanced and high-performing cars available in Korea today. At GM, we intend to continue leading the transformation. And this is why. Today, today, I am so pleased to officially announce that the game-changing Chevrolet Volt EV will be introduced in the first half of 2017. This vehicle was developed using GM's world-leading electric vehicle technologies that will satisfy the Korean customers' highest expectations and their desire for innovation. The Bolt EV will be a tremendous addition to our entire Chevrolet lineup and represent GM's biggest advancement among electric vehicles. As we have just seen in the video, I just demonstrated that from a single charge, you can travel from Busan to Seoul. The Bolt EV's range, 383 kilometers, is certified by the Environmental Protection Agency in the US. It is truly unprecedented. 